Hello and welcome to Nigeria Today on TVC News. Fresh concerns are arising as a nationwide strike embarked on by staff of the National Identity Management Commission, NIMSI, has stalled the national identification registration process. The workers lament the rush at the registration centers has exposed them to the COVID-19 pandemic. They are also demanding the payment of their allowances and other benefits. We'll bring you reports from a few locations across the country, filed in by our correspondent Sarah Ayeku, Ovitemi George and Uchi Okuru. A padlock on the gate of the National Identity Management Commission sends a clear message to applicants for the national identification number. The staff of the commission in Bayonso State is not working today due to some reasons beyond the management of the office in Yenagoa. We are employed in 2013 and upon employment we are expected to pay 28 days allowance. Up to now we've not been paid the 28 days allowances. More than seven years. More than seven years. We want the federal government to prevail on the Director General of National Identity Management Commission and the Minister for Communication and Digital Economy to ensure that our demands, the improved salaries for also uh, COVID-19 PPEs, working tools, overtime allowance, and also weekend allowances which they promised to pay. 2013 when we were employed, our salary was about 80-something thousand at level 8. As we go up, our salary has dropping. We were promised a new salary structure last year, and it has been approved. It, but it was not captured. We have also been captured as essential service providers. We don't have those benefits. Again, the provision of uh, COVID-19 PPEs, we have not seen any. Outside the premises of the office, applicants for the national identification number take shelter nearby, hoping the matter will be resolved soon. Many of us abandon our jobs in respect of this uh, NIN number issue. So we went to this place now, it says strike. Some of us are coming down from far, 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 southern Asia, Ikremo, Nembe. The staff are here are unable to attend to even one person. They did not attend to anybody. So I want the federal government to do something to make sure they provide every necessary equipment to equip them to go to work. They didn't pay them the allowance. Would that be our cup of tea, would that be our business? I think that should be between them and federal government. Okay, now if there is anything like that, they should tell us. They keep us standing till the next minute, they just bring a placard and say there is no work. So they should have given us an early information so that everybody will know how to, to, to put their house in order. I still appeal to federal government. They should extend this date. No new salary structure. No work. No overtime allowance. No work. Ovietime George, TVC News, Yenagoa.